Puebla. What is good, YouTube? It is the one and only Alpha Boy here, and in today's video, I have Rockstar Editor's review. All right, so I've been playing around with this for yeah about a week, or has it been two weeks? I don't know how long it's been out. I forgot. <laughs> But yeah, I've been playing around with it for one to two weeks and finally got a review for y'all and telling y'all how it is and what How good it is and what can make it better. All right, so after saying all that, let's get into it. Now, Rockstar Editor is for PS4, Xbox One, and PC. Now, it is where you can create short films, cinematic movies, and clips and make your ideas come to life with GTA Online. Now, this is built into GTA Online. You know, I had fun playing around with it and making short films and clips and it is awesome awesome add-on to your game all right but there are things that can make it better in director's mode now this is just strictly director's mode now it is a good thing record and everything online and stuff but director mode this is what can make director's mode better all right the first thing is spawning you should be able to spawn cars and props that you want into your clips short films and movies now there is no way for you to spawn cars or like say if I want to put um, a gate here, I can't spawn a gate here. I can't spawn a fire hydrant here. You know, it, they should have that stuff in direct mode because it is called direct mode for a reason. That you should be able to spawn cars and spawn props, just like in when you're in creators mode and you're creating yourself a job and how you can add props and you can add a wall, you can add a, a big trailer or broken bus stuff like that. You know that would make it awesome for you to put props into your um, movie and make it even better. Now. The second thing is the workers in the store. Now, when you're in, and when you're in director's mode, there are no sales associates in the store, so there really isn't a reason to step foot in the stores unless you want to go in there and steal P's and Q's without dealing with the cops. <laughs> but yeah, just like I said, it's nobody there, so it's really it's, it's boring. You know, just running around in director's mode. You know, you can do other stuff, think of other stuff, but I wanted to make a film when I was able to go and rob the store. You know, when I first was thinking about it, I was like, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Now I went to go started to make it in and stuff. I had the um, camera and everything set up. Ran inside the store, nobody was there. It was empty. So at first I thought it was like, oh, I guess this store just doesn't have that person. I went to each and every store and there's nobody there. And even some of the stores you can't even go into. The doors are locked and closed. So they should add the workers into it so that way it can make it um you can do what you know what you want in the store, say if you want to make a thing when you rob the store or if you're just going in the store to buy clothes or something. Now you can do this, but the only thing is you gotta go online. And who wants to go online when you're in director's mode and you can take the cops off and edit the world how you want? So it'll make it better. Now this is the third and last thing, and this thing will make it this right here will make it um the best. You know, it will make creators mode amazing. All right. Actors. Now there aren't any actors that you can use to interact with. For instance, if you want to walk around with a partner while being a cop, you can't do that because there's no actors. All right. Now if you go into creators mode to create a capture job, you will see the ability to add actors and have them do what you want. Now this should be added to director's mode to make your movies better and more fun because if I can go around being a cop and have a partner walk around with me and kill the things that I kill and stuff like that, or even have an actor. Um, who drives a car and I pull him over and pretend like I'm a cop that will be amazing I mean, it's like I said, it's called director's mode for a reason this had this should have been added when Rockstar even thought about this This should have already been in the game They should have thought about this that they was going to create something called director's mode They know what director mean if you're making a movie you'll be able to add what you want in the prop You can make anything that you think of coming on life when you're making a movie now this should have been added to Rockstar Editor. Now, now, these three things can make Rockstar Editor Director's Mode 10 times better. It would give us a chance to bring our ideas to life. But it, but after all saying all that, it is an awesome, you know, add-on. And I suggest you try it out if you have a PS4, Xbox One, or PC, and if you have GTA. Now, if you want to get, if you don't know how to get the Rockstar Editor, all you got to do is just press the start menu while you're in story mode. And you just scroll over to the right and you'll see the tab that says Rockstar Editor. I think that you can get to this in GTA Online. I'm not sure. I think you can though if you you know just doing the same thing pressing start and then going all the way over to the um rockstar editor tab but it's like i said it's you know it's a great add-on to the game you know rockstar that was awesome but if you just listen to these three things that i have um that i have stated in this video just go ahead and add that to the game to the rockstar editor because it would make it so much better but if you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up button and also smack, punch, blow up. Whatever you do, just hit that subscribe button. It's the one on the Afro boy. And guess what? <laughs> I'm out. Peace.